we need to sit and think this through. There has to be a way. We need to sit and... So much for the final A on solving everything. So much for the final A. Crush this and we'll lose everything. We need to plan carefully. Rush this and we'll... May I help you? Thank you. Your patronage is very much appreciated. I'm no good. At all. What are you talking about? All this time I've been thinking about how to defeat Sin. But I... Beyond the teachings of Yevon... I... I know nothing. I'm sorry. Yuna, no apologies. But... Apology is running. Yuna, never run away. <laughs> Thank you, Kamari. So, uh, Kamari, you got any good ideas? Yevon's teachings. The teachings won't help us fight sin. No answer in the teachings. Answers lie outside. Must know both sides to find answer. Both sides? Micah knows much. Find him. Make him talk. That's it! Kimari, you rock! <clears throat> Kimari doubts Micah welcomes us. He'll have to run pretty fast to beat this airship. We cannot chase if we cannot see. We must go to Bavel. To Bavel, then. Through the front door! You worried? I'll be fine. We can't stop now. We must go. Maybe we'll find answers in Bavel. Hey guys, I just had a great idea. It was my idea. Let me tell them. It's like this, yeah? I just thought... The hymn's the key. Ah! The hymn? Sir Jack likes the hymn of the faith, correct? Yeah. That's why he was listening to it in Makalania. Sin, violence incarnate, listening peacefully. Uh, I know it's you, old man. And I don't mean no disrespect, but... No, it's fine. I've gotten used to it. Let me say it. If we attack Sin head-on, we've little chance of winning. However, if he hears the hymn of the faith, he will become docile. Yeah, and that's when we make our move. Uh... Might be against the rules and all, but who's keeping track, yeah? Yeah? Yeah, it could really work. Yeah, yeah, it's worth a try. Well, I guess it's all or nothing. Well, it really was my idea, you know. I got a good feeling about this. Let's see what 
Micah does now. Let's see. Lady Yuna has become quite the summoner. A gentle nature, yet strong as steel. She reminds me of her parents. Yuna's old man was a priest of Yevon, but he married an Albed, huh? Lord Braska wanted peace between his people and ours. He would occasionally visit the home of those days. So that's how he met Sid's sister? They ran off together into the night. Hmm. Sounds like love. Wow, Sid must have been furious. Yes, he wouldn't talk to her after that. But when Yuna was born, they made up again. His sister took off for home at once. But then her ship. Sin. That incident turned Lord Braska down the summoner's path. Everything leads back to sin. But you'll put an end to it. With a vengeance. I pray for your success. Well, that sounds like a plan to me. Our baby here will take us anywhere we want. Infidel! Man, don't these guys ever give up? You regret showing your face here? We'll strike you down in the name of Yevon! <sighs> blah, blah, blah. Yeah, so guys... If they want to fight, let's give them one! Prepare to charge! Stop! Captain? Lady Yuna is not to be harmed. She's no traitor. That is an evil rumor spread by the Albed. What? Maester Micah himself told me. Then what are we to do? Stun down! As she says. What was that about evil Albed? I... Truly, I do not understand it myself. Oh, Yevon seems to be in a state of confusion. Why, yesterday... They called me out of the blue and made me captain of the guard. <laughs> Short on believers? Yes, the chaos in the temples is worse than I'd imagined. It's horrible. And all the priests do is blame each other. I worry what will become of Yevon. But no! I must be the rock that stands against the swirling tides, right? <laughs> Lady Yuna, I must tell you, your courage has been a great inspiration to me. Yeah, that's great, but we came here to see Maester Micah. Is he here? Y yes, uh, I shall arrange an audience. Please wait in the courtroom. Hey! Hey! Wait! What was all that about the Albed lying and stuff? Simple. Yuna has become Micah's only hope. Okay. Just what does he think he can get away with? Time to teach him some manners. Yes, let's. Why are you here? You must go and defeat Sin quickly. You have obtained the final Aeon from Unaleska, have you not? Well, we did meet her. We fought and defeated her. What? Summoners and Guardians will be sacrificed for the final summoning no more. You have profaned and subverted a thousand-year-old tradition. Fools! Infants! Do you realize what you've done? You've taken away the only means of calming sin. 
Hey, maybe that's not the only way. We think we've got another. Why? Preposterous. There is no other way. The Grand Maester running away. Spira has lost its only hope. Destruction is inevitable. You Yevon's spiral of death will consume us all. I have no desire to watch Spira die. It won't die. Who is this Yu Yevon guy? Lady Unaleska also mentioned him. Wait, Gramps! Who's Yu Yevon? He who crafts the souls of the dead into unholy armor. An armor called Sin. Clad in it, you, Yevon, is invincible. I'm the only thing that could have pierced that armor. You have destroyed! Nothing can stop it now. Ah! Disappear on us, will you? Rotten son of a trooper! Where... where is the Grand Maester? He, um... He's not here yet. How long must we wait? That's odd. I'll go look for His Grace. It's you. Come to my room. Okay. Who are you talking to? Oh, uh, no one. I must go see the Faith. <laughs> I see. Hello. I must thank you for the Aeon. So what's up? So, have you found a way to truly defeat Sin? Well... Well? We think the Hymn of the Faith might slow Sin down. Hmm. Perhaps. You mean it won't work? A very long time has passed since your father became Sin. He may not be able to hear the Hymn anymore. I know it's a long shot, but we gotta try it if there's a chance. Yes, you must. I'm glad you're doing this. You have a good spirit, truly. I'm not just a dream, right? A dream? Uh, it's a long story. If it works, what'll you do then? You need more than the hymn. Well... Well? We fight Yu Yevon. Yes. If you defeat Yu Yevon, it will end. Tell me, what do you know about Yu Yevon? He's what makes Sin come back. Sin is his armor. It protects him. Yu Yevon was once a summoner long ago. He was peerless. Yet now he lives for one purpose, only to summon. He is neither good nor evil. He is awake, yet he dreams. But maybe not forever. Yeah, that's right. Because we're ending it. Yes. Even if you defeat Sin with the final summoning, Yu Yevon will live. Yu Yevon will join with the final Aeon. He will transform it into a new Sin. Yu Yevon merges with the Aeon. Then, protected by this new Sin he has created, Yu Yevon continues the summoning. For eternity, huh? But. You know there is no such thing as eternity if you end it, is there? 
Uh huh. Yu Yevon lives inside Sin. Yuna, listen. When you fight Yu Yevon, we will help you. Promise me you'll summon us. I'm afraid your swords and magic won't be enough. Please call us. Promise? Yes. But you know... When it is all over, we will wake and our dream will end. Our dream will vanish. Yeah. You've been dreaming a long time, haven't you? I'm sorry. I'm grateful. About what? Oh, nothing. Hey, don't make that face. Come on, we're gonna beat Sin. Uh, let's see some cheer, okay? You're hiding something. I'm not. Really? You're a bad liar, you know? <laughs>